my name is Rich, recently divorced and gone uh, back into my old habits of uh, the past. And that's kind of where I'm at right now. Just uh, not really, not looking for anything more in life right now. I honestly wish that I'd never gotten back into this uh, lifestyle because I lost a very good marriage. I uh, have a three-year-old little boy who I have not seen since October 11th of 2019. I actually came to Colorado on the 3rd of, of uh, July with the intentions of getting a gram of heroin and killing myself. My, uh, my car, somebody took the drain plug out of the oil pan and I uh, was trying to go to the mountains but my car obviously wouldn't hold any oil after it was tampered with and so I just did it where I was in the parking lot of a Circle K. As this was early, it was about 6.30 p.m. on the 5th of, of uh, July. And I woke up uh, probably about 1.30 in the morning in the ER over there in uh, Boulder. I remember a fire in my body and the nurse gave me another uh, injection of Narcan. She said that I'd uh, stopped breathing again and uh, it's an uncomfortable feeling. It's, uh, it works, obviously, a gram of heroin would kill an elephant. From what I was told, they had to do uh, chest compressions and really work on me with this, uh, this last overdose. They, they didn't have an easy time bringing me back, but the, the Narcan was, it, it, if you want to have your life saved, it's, it's pretty beneficial and it actually works rather quickly. They actually got upset with me because I was upset that I was there. That's not my intentions. My intentions were absolutely not to be uh, getting help or administering, uh, anybody administering life-saving uh, drugs. So I was rather uh, they were upset with me because I was not showing my gratitude for them saving my life. They didn't offer me any uh, any kind of help. In fact, when the police took me from there to the impound yard, they would not let me have anything. No shoes, no shirt, no wallet, no phone, no money, nothing out of my car. And then uh, the hospital kept my shirt and my shoes and I ended up having to walk from the uh, impound yard with hospital socks all the way to Boulder. I had the money to get my car back at the time, but because they kept it for uh, an investigation, they had a hold on it, so by the time the hold was lifted, I could no longer afford to get my car back, thereby making me uh, stranded, homeless, and uh, still very unhappy.